Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am sharing how to make your own customized QR code intro. Okay, so first of all, open any browse. I am you choose Chrome browser. Then go to uh, www.qrcodemonkey.com. Check my description. Then first uh, create your own uh, URL from your website or any other URL. Then copy and paste it to here. Then uh, click on the set the color. Here I am choosing color gradient. Then I am changing the color. Okay, and you can add a logo image to here. I am just trying to try to just show you how to add it. it just click on browse. It's come uh, automatically. Sometimes it will take lag. Then choose the click on customize design uh, okay. here is the first square is uh, eyeball uh, eye frame shape eye frame shape and the eyeball shape is the inner side of the small uh, square and the body shape means the inside of the fossil uh, fossils okay it's showing but the net issue then click on create qr code Okay, our QR code generated and I, I want to change my logo After all done, just click on the download PNG. Download your QR code PNG and open. Okay, our uh, QR code is working. Generated successfully. Then open your highlight motion. Click on new project, then choose a shape from here and I click on create project. First add your uh, logo to here and adjust the size.
our logo duration is 33 seconds then select the layer again go to effect then add effect search or choose the chroma key then select the green screen preset choose white okay and adjust the feather uh, using the chroma key and adjust the threshold ok it's done then select the layer then go to effect then click on the add effect search it uh, block dissolve and click on transition in preset ok the transition is working perfectly then again click on add effect and search it block dissolve choose transition out show the preview okay and adjust the transition out because the tra transition out take a short time okay then next we are choosing the glitch sound effect to here then click on the plus button with uh, the audio select your glitch sound from here mark when the uh, glitch effect coming through the marking that is the uh, sound effect adjust the end mark and glitch effect split the sound effect then add the move the sound effect based on the uh, glitch transition out effect then i show the preview then finally export the video uh, or in case uh, you don't want to uh, or group it just group it the video select all layer and click on the first option okay. Okay, then add a video to here i show how to work it first uh, move the main intro to up uh, forward front of the video select the uh, video footage then go to effect click on add effect choose the blur then choose inner blur ok Okay, adjust the blur value split the blur after the intro and click on the second split layer then go to effect select the inner layer first add a frame key then add a frame key and uh, adjust the blur value
you can see the blur value going automatically good well then uh, add this to the first layer footage opacity because we are focusing the intro only I think it's working fine uh, then split your uh, uh, trim your areas then export into your gallery okay thank you